inflate your balloon till you have a little less than half an inch here of uninflated end. You're gonna want the balloon fairly full and fairly tight because it helps you to make a better heart, as you'll see. So we're gonna start with just a little inflation. This is really pretty simple. Uh, we're going to start at our nozzle and let's start with a pinch twist. So remember before you make a basic twist, always pinch first your fingers and then do the twisting if you're new to all this. So we're gonna make first a basic twist. Now, I'm gonna turn this into a pinch twist and I'm gonna take the nozzle, place it into the twist here and then twist it into a pinch twist. Let me show you what that looks like. So I grab and that is a pinch twist there. Now, this pinch twist, we're going to form a handle here on the balloon. So we're just going to do a pinch, another pinch twist here, and then this part will form the handle, this part here will form the heart. Let's do that. So basic twist, now we're gonna turn this into a pinch twist. So remember to fold them together, and you're going to pull this and twist. And we have a pinch twist there, a pinch twist here, and then we're gonna twist these two together. Notice for stability, I have the pinch twists on opposite sides, and that allows for stability of the balloon itself. So when people hold it, it doesn't uh, flop around as much. So you'll find very stable. Now we have to turn this loop into our heart. So what we're going to do is just kind of pinch and find the midsection here, or the middle point, and we're going to Bring it down just like this. Now this is the part that might be a little confusing because we're going to convert this into a heart and pretty much it's just a forming process where by using the heat in your hands and just kind of wiggling the balloon around, you're going to form the heart. So let me show you a couple techniques. One is to grab here, pinch and pull and you want to stretch this out. So it kind of forms a permanent bend in the heart. Notice how I squeezed here as I pulled. So you can do that a couple times, see what you end up with. And that's actually a pretty decent heart right there. Now, one more thing is, if you want, you can out, if you get something that's kind of uh, elongated, you don't like the shape, I'm really happy with this heart shape, but you can do something like this that will help to round it up. But that is a pretty decent heart shape right there. And now you have your heart wand made from a single balloon.